guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Katie and I'm here with another weekly Walmart grocery haul for my family of five. I have my meal plan I'm gonna share with you guys. And then if you're new here, I always share the prices as I have found that that's helpful for some people as they're trying to plan their own grocery list and meal plan for the week. So this week we're gonna be having some type of pasta. I have a couple kinds of noodles in the pantry. So um, I also got like ground beef, I have sauce, I got cheese. Um, so I haven't exactly decided whether that's gonna be spaghetti, lasagna, something, I don't know. I have options. So some kind of pasta. I'm gonna be making hamburger casserole. That is kind of a staple around here. It is so good and so easy. It's my grandma's recipe. Um, we're gonna do tacos one night, you know, always. And then I think I'm gonna do like an appetizer night. I've been craving um, buffalo chicken dip. It is one of my favorite things to make. It's just, like I could eat it by itself. So I like to do appetizer nights where I'll make like a dip and maybe slider sandwiches and it's just kind of fun. So we're gonna do that one night this week and that is my meal plan for this week. Those four nights, y'all know that the weekends are always crazy around here and up in the air. So I don't usually plan for weekends. We eat leftovers, we go out, we go to my dad's house or friend's houses or whatever. All right, let's get into this haul and let me show you what I got. Okay, here's a little overview. If my voice sounds a little weird, I have had like the sniffles all week. So I sound a little froggy, but that's okay. <laughs> Ignore it. All right, I grabbed a thing of Campbell's chicken noodle soup and Campbell's cream of mushroom soup. Both of those I use in my hamburger casserole. Sometimes I get the Walmart brand, but honestly, I just, I like the Campbell's brand. I don't know. I grabbed another one of these little cheese balls. This one is the smoky bacon flavor. Um, oh, I forgot to put on my meal plan, <laughs> but me and my husband are going to do a charcuterie night one night, just the two of us and the kids will eat like frozen pizza or whatever. So that is for that. I found the Texas Roadhouse Rolls. I, if you watched my haul last week, I talked about how I wanted to make this um, like chicken Chick-fil-A chicken mini dupe thing that I saw on, I don't know, TikTok or somewhere. And I needed these and Walmart was out of them last week. So this week they had them. So I grabbed them and I might film that or at least post about it on Instagram if it turns out good. So stay tuned. If you're not following me on Instagram, my uh, username on there is the same as my YouTube channel. It's Life with the Love Days, so go follow me over there. I grabbed some of these crispy crowns. I thought that those would be good to go with the Chick-fil-A thing that I'm going to be doing. I grabbed some ricotta for whatever pasta I decide to make. The kids requested more of these pizza bagels, so we got that for them. And my son requested some breakfast sandwiches, so I got that. I grabbed some tortillas for taco night. We were out of American cheese, so I grabbed a 24 count of that. I grabbed this Borson um, cheese. I have never actually tried this, but there was a, I can't remember if it was the Ibotta cashback offer or the Walmart app cashback offer, but there was a cashback offer. And I have seen all over TikTok people using this to make like really fun, appetizer dips and stuff for the holidays so I want to try it I'm gonna I don't know what dip I'm gonna try yet I need to go back on TikTok and look and see the ones that I have watched before but I'm gonna try it and hopefully it turns out good let me know if you've ever tried that this is another new thing I've never tried before Grillo's pickles pickled de gallo that looks so good pickle salsa what have you guys ever tried this look at it I love pickles. Anytime I get like a burger or a sandwich or something that has pickles on it, I always get extra pickles because they're my favorite. So that sounds really good to me. We're going to try that on our tacos. I grabbed some cabbage cheese because we were out. I grabbed some of this. Um, this is like the Walmart uh, version of Pepto for kids. And I like to keep this in the cabinet for whenever they get a little upset tummy. This seems to help a lot. Um, some Parmesan cheese for the pasta. I needed a bell pepper for um, the casserole. And just seeing this reminded me. So I ordered bananas and strawberries and they refunded both and said that they were all out. 
So how is Walmart all out of strawberries and bananas? I don't know. So we didn't even get <laughs> strawberries and bananas this week. So I don't know. I'll have to run to our little local grocery store and see if they have it instead. Our Sargento cheese that we get every single week. I grabbed these King's Hawaiian rolls. I grabbed two things of Lucky Charms because if you bought two, you got like a dollar off. I think in the Walmart app and the kids have been asking for cereal and I haven't bought it in a while because cereal is expensive. I got bagels. This is not the usual brand that I usually get. Y'all know I like the Thomas ones, but this was a substitution. So I don't know. Hopefully the kids don't mind. Grabbed a big block of cheddar to shred up for half of it will be for the buffalo dip and half of it will be for the casserole. And then I grabbed a big bag. This was supposed to be just mozzarella by itself, but again, this was a substitution. I don't think I've actually ever tried the provolone and mozzarella blend, but that actually sounds good. So hopefully it is. I grabbed three of these pizza Lunchables for the kids to have one day this week for lunch. I grabbed a bag of coleslaw to go with when I make the casserole. That just pairs really well with it. I grabbed the kids for snacks some pretzel sticks and then some of the white cheddar popcorn. They really like both of those. I grabbed the wheat thins for the charcuterie board, milk for the week. I got this for our charcuterie board. It has three different kinds of meats in there. I grabbed a thing of ground beef because we needed a little bit more. I grabbed this thing of frozen, um, or maybe it's just refrigerated, I don't know steak fajitas and they're fully cooked so you just have to warm them up so that will be really good to do with taco you know usually i do ground beef tacos every now and then i'll do chicken tacos but we do tacos pretty much every week and i like to continue to switch it up so we're gonna do this on our tacos this week and i think it will be really good we got some scoops for the buffalo dip and then i had to get my you guys know that i usually like Water is my drink of choice. I also really like coffee. I don't drink a lot of soda, but when I do drink soda, I know I shared, I think last week, that cranberry ginger ale with you guys. That is one of my favorites, but I usually can only find it around the holidays and I don't ever see it the rest of the year. But Dr. Pepper Zero Sugar is my other favorite. And every now and then you just need like that carbonation. Just something about it. So good every now and then. So I got myself a pack of those. That will last me a while. And that is my entire haul for this week. Okay, guys, that's it for this week's haul. I will have to go find strawberries and bananas. And I feel like there was another thing that they said that they didn't have. I don't know. I felt like there was a lot of substitutions this week. I don't know. Like, I always do my grocery hauls or I do my pickup orders for between 7 and 8 a.m. on Tuesday mornings. That's my usual time. Um, so I do it early in the morning. So I feel like why there shouldn't be that many substitutions. And there's usually not. So I don't know what it was about today. But no bananas, no strawberries. We'll have to go find those somewhere else. Hopefully you guys enjoy this haul. Hopefully it gave you some grocery shopping inspiration or meal plan inspiration. I really appreciate you watching. If you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like watching grocery hauls, please subscribe and stick around because I post these every single week. And in fact, I have an entire playlist on my channel just dedicated to grocery hauls. So if you really enjoy watching them, you can definitely check that out. But I love you guys. I appreciate you. And I hope you have a great rest of your day wherever you are. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.